Oh, old are you, my pretty fair maid? Oh, old are you, my honey? How old are you, my pretty little miss? How old are you, my honey? She answered me quite cheerfully, I am seventeen come Sunday. She answered me with a modesty, I'll be sixteen next Sunday. She with me dear, I'm a da, father it love, father a little I owe. Bottle like a do, do, oh, do, and a bottle like a do, da, da. She must stay at home, but the oldest I'll take away. Come in, come in, all seven of my son, and guide your sister around. For it never shall be said that the steward's son has taken my daughter out of town. She made him suck them all. Says he, old woman, I am so blind I cannot see at all. Sing to the yum, sing to the yum, whack for lolly day. Says he, I'd go and drown myself if I could only see. Says she, my dearest husband, I'll go and show you the way. Sing to the yum, sing to the yum, whack for lolly day. She bundled him up in his old gray coat. She took him to the brim. Says he, I cannot drown myself unless you push me in. Sing to the yum, sing to the yum, whack for lolly day. The old woman took a step or two back to give a roll and sprang. The old man stepped a little to the side and she went tumbling in. Sing to the yum, sing to the yum, whack for lolly day. She bubbled and gurgled and squalled out as loud as she could bawl. Says he, old oh woman, I'm so blind I can't see you at all. Sing to the yum, sing to the yum. <laughs> I used to be a rambler, I stayed around in town. I used to be a rambler, I stayed around in town. I courted pretty Polly, and the beauty's never been found. There was an old man, he lived near hell. He had a little farm and upon it did dwell, sing hi a rattle ding day. Oh, the devil come to him one day at his plow. There's one in your family I have to have now, sing hi a rattle ding day. Oh, it's neither your son nor your daughter I crave. It's your old scolding wife, and it's her I must have, sing hi. Oh, two little devils come rattling their chains. 
She hauled back her cudgel and knocked out their brains, sang hi oh rattle ding day Two more little devils peeped over the wall. <whistles> Said, take her back, Daddy, or she'll kill us all, sang hi oh rattle ding day So he hobbled her up all on his back. <whistles> and like a bold peddler went a pack in her back, sang hi oh rattle ding day Here's your old scolding wife, and it's her I won't have. She ain't fit for heaven, she ain't stay in hell, saying hi, oh, rattle, ding, day. Oh, it's seven years going and seven are coming back. She called for the backer she left in the crack, saying hi, oh, rattle, ding, day. Oh, the women, they are so much better than men. When they go to hell, they get sent back again, saying hi, oh, rattle, ding, day. Oh, she got up. And her milk white steel, and he and apple grey rode along unto the north strand. Was three long hours before day. She's mounted on a milk white steed, and he on a dapple grey. And they rode till they come to a lonesome spot, a cliff by the side of the sea, a cliff by the side of the sea. Oh, get down, get down, pretty Polly, he said. Get down and get down to me. Tis six little girls that I drowned it here. And you are the seven shall be. Light down, light down, said false Sir John. Your bridal bed you see. It's seven women have a drowned here. And the eighth and you shall be. And the eighth and you shall be. my son oh where have you been my handsome young one i've been to the wild wood mother make my bed soon for i'm weary with hunting and i fain would lie down what is that blood on thy shirt sleeve my son come tell it unto me Tis the blood of my dear brother who I killed under yonder tree. Who I killed under yonder tree. How came that blood on your shirt sleeve? Oh, dear love, tell me. Oh, it is the blood of my brother in law that went away with me, 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 that went away with me. What will thou do when thy father comes home? My son, come tell it unto me. I'll plant my foot on board a ship and sail across the sea, and sail across the sea. And it's what will you do now, my love? Oh, dear love, tell me, I'll set my foot on you. Ship and I'll sail across the sea, 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 sail across the sea. Lord Bateman was a noble lord, a noble lord of some high degree. He shipped in saddles on board of a ship, some foreign country he would go see. Lord Bateman was a noble lord. 
He thought himself of a high degree. He could not rest nor be contented till he had sailed the old salt sea. We sail at east and we sail at west until he came to put out our feet. Where he was taken and put in prison until his life it grew quite weary. Oh, he sailed east and he sailed to the westward. He sailed all over to the Turkey shore. There he got caught and put in prison, never to be released anymore. No, Joseph was an old man. And an old man was he, and he married Mary, the Queen of Galilee. And he married Mary, the Queen of Galilee. When Joseph were an old man, and an old man were he, he courted the Virgin Mary and the Queen of Galilee. He courted the Virgin Mary and the Queen of Galilee. Was in the pleasant month of May when green leaves they were springing. A young man on his deathbed lay for the sake of Barry Ellen. A young man on his deathbed lay. For the sake of Barbary Ellen. All in the merry month of May, when the green buds they were swelling, young William Green on his deathbed lay for the love of Barbary Ellen. He sent for her a servant maid to the place that she was dwelling. I pray thee come and see my master if your name be Bob Ellen. He sent his servant to the town to the place where she was dwelling, saying, Master's sick and he sends for you, if your name be Barbara Ellen. Oh, I'm been stand here for a while, for I seems to see my dear old father, he's a coming over yonder style. Hangman, hangman, slack up your rope, oh slack it for a while. I look down yonder and I seen Paul coming, he's walked for many long miles. Oh father, has I got any gold or silver to set me free? For to keep my body from the cold clay ground, and me neck from the eye gallus tree. Oh, Paul, say, Paul, have you brung me any gold, any gold to pay my fee? Or have you walked these many long miles, see me on the hanging tree? There were seven little gypsies all in a row, as we went down to Strabali. And I wouldn't give a kiss off a gypsy lassie's lips for all old Squire Cash's money, oh. There were three gypsies that came to my door, and downstairs ran this a lady, oh. One sang high, and the other sang low, and the other sang bonny, bonny biscay, oh. 
And what is meaner than womankind? And you were the weaver's bonny. A babe's more innocent than a lamb. Sing ninety-nine and ninety. And the devil is meaner than womankind. And I am the weaver's bonny. Oh, you have answered my questions nine. Sing ninety-nine and ninety. And you were God's, you were none of mine. And you were the weaver's bonny. My father, he was a rich old jade. My mother, she was a lady fair. And me a being the only heir. So love has brought me to despair. It's when I wore my long silk gown he followed me from town to town. But now my apron just will tie. He passes my door and he won't stop in. There is a street in yonder's town where my true love walks up and down. He takes another girl on his knee and tells to her what he won't tell me. He takes another girl on his knee. Oh, ain't it an awful grief to me. There is some flowers I've heard them say that would cure false love both night and day. And off these flowers I did pull until I got my apron full. I gathered black, I gathered blue, but none of these flowers could I find that would cure false love or ease my mind. It's out of these leaves I made a bed and out of the flowers a pillow for my head. Is down she lay, and nary word spoke, until her aching heart was broke. And in the green meadows round, I thought I heard a doleful sound. Well met, well met, my old true love. Well met, she replied to me. I'm just returning from the salt, salt sea. It's all for the love of thee. I could have married the queen's daughter, she would have married me, but I forsake on the silver and her gold, it's all for the love of thee. If you could have married the queen's daughter, I'm sure you'd have better been. For I am married to a house carpenter. I think he's a nice young man. If you will leave your house carpenter and come along with me, I'll take you across the Abram Bailey had three sons, the youngest one was sent her all through the wild woods he went, just like a jovial hunter, blowed his horn, both east and west, blow your horn, sent her, and on his way went again, just like a jovial hunter. 
Abram Bailey had three sons. The youngest one was sent her all through the wild woods. He went just like a Job hunter. Blow, blow his horn, both east and west. Blow your horn, center, and on his way went again, just like a Job hunter. Abram Bailey had three sons. The youngest one was sent her all through the wild woods. He went just like a Job hunter. Blow, blow his horn, both east and west. Blow your horn, center, and on his way went again, just like a Job hunter. Another one I like. Uh, yeah, there's several more verses to that. I just there uh, not got time to finish saying it, but uh, it's several more verses of it. It's an old song. I'm going to play Pretty Fair Maiden now. I like it. It's a pretty tune. Abram Bailey had three songs. Blow your horn center. And he is to the wild wood gone, just like a jovial hunter. As he marched down the green wood side, blow your horn, center. A pretty girl, oh, there he spied, as he was a jovial hunter. Is a wild boar all in these woods. Blow your horn, center. He slew the Lord and his sporty men, as you are the jovial hunter. How can I this wild boar see? Blow your horn, center. Wind up your horn and he'll come to you. As you are the jovial hunter, he wound his horn unto his mouth. Blow your horn, center. He blew east, north, west, and south. As he was the jovial hunter, the wild boar hid him unto his den. Blow your horn, center. I went down to Darby's house on a market day. There I found the finest drum that was ever fed on hay. Fall all day, fall all little all day. The wool on the lamb's belly it dragged nine miles on the ground. I went down to Darby's house and sold a thousand pounds. Fall all day, fall all little all day. The wool on the lamb's back, it reached up to the sky. The eagles built their nests there to hear the youngins cry. Fall all day, fall all little all day. Every tooth he had held a half a bushel of corn. Every foot he had covered a half acre of ground. Fall all day, fall all little all day. The one that held his head got drowned in the blood. The one that cut his throat got washed away in the flood. Fall all day, fall all little all day. When I went up to London town upon a market day, the finest ram which I did see was ever fed be high to me. I did lum darby, I did lum day, I did lum darby upon a market day. The hand growed on his head, sir, they growed so high and tall. That killed the ram, sir, was up to his knees in blood. There was five and twenty butcher boys got worse to wind the flood. For it's I diddle them darby, I diddle them day, I diddle them darby upon a market day. Took all the dogs in England to pull away his bones, and all the women in England to roll away his pendulums to me. I diddle them darby. I diddle them day, I diddle them derby upon a market day. Now the fellow that owned the rams, sir, he must have been very rich, 
And the brother could sing the song, sure as a lion, son of a bitch, to me, I did a little derby. I did a little day, I did a little derby, up on a market day. Now, you do lady, a lady gay. I'm children, she had three. She sent them away to a north country. That do learn the most grammarly. They hadn't been gone but a very short while. Scarce fly three weeks. When Robin Hood was about eighteen years old, he chanced to meet little John. A jolly brisk blade just fit for his trade, all for he was a sturdy young man. Although he was little, his limbs they were not. His stature was seven feet high. Wherever he came, he soon quickened his pain, and presently caused them to fly. One day these two met on a long, narrow bridge, and neither of them would give way. Then Robin stepped up to the stranger and said, I'll show you brave Nottingham's play. You've talked like a coward, the stranger, he said, as there with your long bow you stand. I vow and protest you may shoot at my breast while I have just a staff in my hand. The name of a coward, said Robin, I scorn, and so my long bow I'll lay by, and then for your sake a staff.